Hey guys, Shadi from Roto Rev and the Mini DVR by Hawkeye <clears throat> and LCD. Um, there was an incident that uh, incident that some website did post, uh, I guess, wrong firmware or something that did brick some of those units if you try to um, flash it with it. Um, and uh, we're just gonna go over this quickly here. So, just not gonna mention which website, but anyways, they still have that firmware up. And once you try to flash the unit with it, um, you'll get um, flash failed or something like this. And um, you will end up with a DVR that just goes into uh, boot loops like this, where it just splashes the uh, logo and keeps going on and on. So, uh, without further details, we're just gonna go through um, how to fix that first of all. So, there is a new firmware that we have here on that card, and along with the steps how to override a bricked unit. So, we will just, sorry, taps up. So what you're gonna need to do is, um, after you upload this, um, the file is gonna be on uh, Rotorev product website, so you can download it from there, the good firmware and the instructions. So you just load the firmware on the, on the root folder on that SD card, um, stick it on the unit, and then push the up button while you're actually powering the unit. Let go of the power when it turns on. Still pressing up. And then let go. It is going to take you into this menu. Hopefully you just can't see that. But it is saying current version that much, upgraded versions that much, whether to upgrade. So you go to OK and hit OK. So it's just going to say... It's gonna tell you to wait while it's flashing it. Try to make sure that you can see that. Okay, so in that case, it says upgrade success. You need to restart, say okay. And just the unit is gonna restart again. And hopefully that fixes your DVR, plus upgrades it to the latest firmware. And here's why people were trying to get that is because of that new um, motion detection feature. I think, I haven't tested that yet, but I think mm, a lot of us would like to have an auto record on so you don't have to worry about recording or not. And it would just detect, I guess, the video uh, movement and then it would start automatically recording. So now that we have this, we can go to menu. I can see that one. And we go down, and you got a new menu that says motion detection. So this is how to get your DVR fixed or upgraded. Um, if you don't really need that feature, there is so far no information about other improvements. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's a good feature to have, and uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.